How to change user password on Windows-like system with Ansible? I'm going to show you a live demo with some simple Ansible code. I'm Luca Burton and welcome in today's episode of Ansible Pilot. Today we are talking about Ansible module win underscore user. The full name is ansible.windows.win underscore user, which means that it is part of a collection of modules specialized to interact with Windows target host. It's a module pretty stable and out for years, and it works in Windows and Windows Server operating system. It manages local Windows user account. For Linux target, use the user module instead. Parameter of win underscore user. The only required is name, that is the username. The state parameter allow us to verify that the user is present or not in the system. So if you specify absent, you actually delete the user. So be careful. The password set the password in clear text. So easy, specify what password assigned to user, no hash function is needed. The update underscore password parameter specify when the module will update the user password. Always option will update password if they differ in any case. On underscore create will only set the password for newly created user. So be careful about this stuff. Uh, let me highlight also some parameter about password expiration. So password underscore never underscore expire to set the password to never expire or password underscore expired force the user to change password and next login. This is very, very useful. Demo time. Let's jump in a real life Ansible playbook to change user password on Windows like system with Ansible playbook. First of all, we need a new password. How to get it? Oh, there is this really nice website of LastPass for generating secure password. Oh, let me switch to English because now it's speaking Italian. So basically you can choose the complexity, uppercase, lowercase, number, symbol, the length, and you can generate as many passwords as you want. So for example, I like this. So let me copy and now is in my clipboard. So basically I'm going to paste in my Ansible clipboard. Welcome to my editor. I'm going to start my Ansible playbook with free dash as a YAML document and a play name. Window change password. That is going to target hosts all of my inventory. Let me define some uh, useful variable. So user name, the name of the user. In my case, example and user password the password of the user. But simply we need to paste the one that we just generated from the tool. So here I am. Here we go. You remember was this. You can customize this variable as much as you want. Only one task named change password. Yeah, a lot of fantasy. That is going to target Ansible dot, uh, what was the collection name? Oh, of course, Windows dot win underscore user. Two parameter, the name will be the value of my variable username and password will be the value of the variable password. Why did I choose uh, to put a variable? Oh, because it's more easy to change in the future and I can pass this value as extra variable. There is a video about. 
So in uh, 10 line, I'm able to change password in all my Windows system. So imagine if you have a 10, 100 or 1000 server, we just need to execute this code in all the server. So let's have fun. First of all, welcome to my Windows system. Let's double check together the state of the example user. So this PC, right click manage and from the server manager dashboard, let me choose on tools, computer management. Here we go. From this panel, I have a local user and group management. And as you can see, there is an example user with everything set it up. So now we can change the password from here. Not really, I'm going to use Ansible Playbook. So let's jump to the terminal. Welcome to my Ansible controller terminal. So let me execute the code with Ansible dash playbook. Let me specify dash E as a parameter. So my inventory file and the playbook name. Now, when we hit enter, Ansible is taking care of everything. It's connecting to the target host using WinRAM, in this case, gathering facts and performing the operation. Changing password is very fast operation, doesn't require a lot of time. As you can see, there is one changed. So password was actually already changed. And what happened if we execute again the same code? Well, let's discover together. I'm expecting one OK status, which means no further operation are needed. And here we are, because password was already changed. So let's double check on the Windows side. Back on my Windows uh, server, on local user and group, uh, I don't see any changes on the example user. So how could I verify if the password was already set it up? Well, in the event viewer, let's take a look together, maybe on the Windows log or security. Uh, let me try to remember where exactly it is. Uh, no, here we have only the log. Log on and log off, so it's under application. Here we go. As you can see, Ansible Windows Win User, and here we have all the information, the interaction. Okay, but we would like to go a little bit more deeper. How we can test it out this stuff? Using the example user login. There is only one way for testing the password. Disconnect from the current administrator and actually enter as an example user. So let me type one by one all this uh, complex password and uh, let's see if uh, it works. Let me show to you the password is the same that we set it up on Ansible, as you can see. So when I hit enter, wow, it's actually working. So we did! Yeah! Well done, Ansible. We are able to change a password with only 10 lines of code. Isn't this magic? It saved a lot of time in my life. Now you know how to change user password on Windows like system with Ansible. This is extremely useful if you need to maintain up to date all your IT infrastructure and your Windows fleet. And in this way, you can maintain the same password for the same user in different systems. And you save a lot of time of manual changing the stuff. If this video was useful for you, Give me a thumbs up, write me a message, and thank you for watching as well. See us then on the next IT adventure of Ansible Pilot. This video is part of our Ansible automation program. Sign up today on www.ansiblepilot.com for uninterrupted exclusive video and so much fun.